defense, if I would have known that being knighted meant that the queen could just dub you whatever she wanted to dub you, I would never have said okay. I mean, I don't want to be Sir Stinky Cheese for the rest of my life. Oh, I thought you were Sir W. Stinky Cheese. What? She she dubbed you. So, W. Stinky Cheese. No, she it was just a remix. It was more of a remix. Oh, yeah. Hi folks, welcome to Pop Off Islam I'm Jeff. I'm Heidi. And we're here to react to another trailer for you. Uh, I threw these at Heidi at the last minute, so we'll see uh, what she thinks about these. Um, so, she, as yes. per usual, I know nothing. <laughs> That's about okay, movies. I don't really know much about these either. Uh, this first trailer is a, a teen horror movie, apparently, uh, called Look Away. This is the official trailer. Uh, stars uh, India Isley, who I'm not familiar with. Name sounds the familiar. The face, yeah, the face on the, the, the thumbnail seemed familiar. Yeah. As well, maybe when we watch the trailer, we'll go, oh, yeah, she's from... That whatever. girl. Probably not. Yeah. But it's possible, oh. you know? So uh, we're going to watch it. We're going to let you know our completely valueless opinions about the thing. And then you can jump into the comments below and let us know what you think about it and whether this is something you're excited for or, you know, not. Not. Right. Well, don't decide that yet. No, I said or it. not. Oh, okay. I'm just filling in the blanks. Gotcha. Here we go. That's not very good. No. It's a jungle out there. You sure you want to go my dad? What? I really didn't need to do that. <laughs> Who are you? You don't remember me? We have a screwed up daughter. She has no friends. He's mine, you know. She has no confidence. This is your time to shine. We're in a surveillance room. Feelings, opinions. So I got a distinct sort of carry vibe from it to begin with, um, but then it didn't look like it was going in that direction. Um, I read a book like a long time ago, like I was in like sixth or seventh grade, I think, and it was probably too young or not really, not really the right age group for me. But it was about this girl who kind of sort of grew a split personality, and the other one was just completely like. The opposite of her. So, um... I remember that. It was called Sister, Sister. It no. used to be on, like, the... That's not the right one? No. Okay. No, that's... Um, it was a book. Oh, first. a book. Gotcha. First. First. Gotcha. Sorry, um, I was thinking. Because the Maori sisters, they're kind of scary. <laughs> No, not them. Um, but it was it was interesting because it was like it was like self growth for the girl who was totally timid and meek and all that, and she had to learn how to be strong to fight this thing that it was taking over her life. Yeah. So it looks like it's kind of taking that sort of vibe too. So like. I don't know. I mean, it looks like it, you know, typical bad, bad teenager high school thing, you know, right. the outcast and, you know, I don't know. Like, it doesn't look awful to me. So I was actually, you know, Jeff told me that we were watching a bunch of uh, trailers this evening and I was like, oh, okay, what are we looking at? And I'm like, is there going to be something that I want to watch? So um, this actually doesn't look bad. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. Yeah. 
Um, this remind, and this is the second time in the last couple of days that I've said something reminded me of something I've written. <laughs> but I don't know if you remember, but when I was in the middle of, of uh, some early drafts for stories that were going into this new book, mm -hmm. there was a story that I wrote about a girl who kept seeing a, a duplicate of herself mm -hmm. um, in the mirror. And there was this notion of... Uh, were they switching places when the girl was asleep? And mm. I didn't finish that story. But right, yeah, 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 like, yeah, I remember that. But this seems like it's along those same lines, that, that the mirror version wants out, and mm -hmm. when she gets out, the other girl is trapped in. Mm -hmm. um, so similar notion there. Uh, Mira Serena, we haven't seen, or at least I haven't seen in a while, so nice to see her in this. Uh, Jason Isaacs is always good mm -hmm. in things that he's in, uh, so cool to see them as the parents. It, it's definitely, definitely has an interesting vibe yeah. Uh, yeah. to it, and, and again, India Isley does look familiar, I just can't place where I've seen her before. Same. She, she did look very familiar. Very familiar. Um, so yeah, I would definitely give this a go. Yeah, I think I would too. Um, and it's not often that, I mean, it's not often. Typically a movie that I haven't heard anything about, there's no buzz about it, um, if I see the first trailer, it's very seldom that I see a trailer and then go, I'm in. Um, usually it takes a trailer or two to kind of convince me. For but, something that doesn't doesn't have like other media support besides right, the trailers. Right, so and I, I literally heard nothing about this before I saw that this trailer had dropped, and so I wanted to watch it. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm in. I, I like the setup, I like the premise, the acting looks decent, the... Uh, uh, cinematography looks good. I mean, it, it looks like a quality production and not just a throwaway mm -hmm. like sci-fi original or something. Not um, that those are bad, but it's no, you know, just, can be just fine. This, the level of quality. Right, but just saying it looks like some time and attention was paid to this mm -hmm. to make something solid. So, now, it could be that they cut a really good trailer together and the movie's trash. But we won't know that until we see it. So I, I'll definitely check this out. I hope that it makes it out. I hope it's not one of those that looks really great. And then I keep watching for it to hit the theater. And then I see it in Redbox and never saw it in the theater. Yeah. I'm, not that there's anything wrong with that. If that's the way that you have to get your film out. Uh, I, please don't hear me saying that. But yeah. I always hate it when I think a movie would look good on the big screen. And would be a solidly entertaining film. And they just don't make it uh, to that stage. So it happens, but hopefully it won't happen with this one. Yeah, so it doesn't look like we have um, a release date. A release date. So At least not on this page. Let me scroll down and see. Yeah, it says 2018. And that's it. So we don't we don't have it. One would hope that something like this would try to be out before Halloween, so people have some choices as to what they want to go see. Like if they're not into the trick or treating crowd, as a parent, and of course children wouldn't be seeing this. So um, you know, something for young adults to go do on Halloween night that's not like a trashy party. So I don't know, but. We don't know when it's coming out. All right. But we'll keep our eyes open and yeah. I'll uh, let you know. And if another trailer drops, we'll check it out too and let you know what we think about that as well. The real question for us now is what do you think about this trailer? Uh, let us know in the comments down below. Is it something that you're excited about? Something you want to see? Um, can you tell us where we've seen India Isley before? If so, please let us know down yeah. there. Yeah, we'll uh, like, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This happens to us all the time. Uh, we watch way too many things for uh, to keep track of everybody. But uh, anyway, those are our thoughts. You comment down below and let us know what you think. And uh, as always, if you like this video that and up. consider subscribing to the channel we love it when you do that we're growing steadily but surely um, and we love every single one of you that climbs aboard this journey with us we really just do this for fun uh, we just like inviting you to the party so um, that's that's kind of why we do this yep and every time there's like a single number added to our subscribers uh, I tell her or she tells me and we have a little mini celebration because we love it yep. um, so yeah that's it for us today uh, until the next time folks bye, bye.